CBS executives are celebrating today after inking a deal for a 30-episode Bloomberg ad. How many Emmys will it win? And are any of you cowards brave enough to teach me how to use my DVR so I can watch it? From the Onion and Onion Public Radio, this is The Topical. I'm your savior, Leslie Price, and I'm about to show you the light, the way, and the news. Stay with us. The Topical is presented by Cash App, the number one finance app in the App Store, and the easiest way to send and receive money. It's so easy, I accidentally sent my entire savings account to some guy in Oregon. (laughs) What will Silicon Valley think of next? Download Cash App today and get $10 when you sign up using promo code TOPICAL. Good news if you're a fan of political ads. CBS Television Studios announced today that the network has inked a deal for a 30-episode advertisement with the Mike Bloomberg campaign. OPR political entertainment reporter Marcy Hammond has been following the story and joins me now. Hi, Leslie. Marcy, tell us about this deal. Well, CBS wanted to build on its already lucrative relationship with Mike Bloomberg. The network has been airing a series of 30-second spots about the late 70-something former New York City mayor who's campaigning to become president of the United States. CBS Studios' executive Kate McNamara called the decision to order up a full series of long-form ads a, quote, no-brainer. I immediately thought... Yes, I absolutely want to follow this character's arc as he goes from podium to podium in various venues, talking about his carefully curated accomplishments and calls for vague new policies. It's fresh, it's relevant, and it represents exactly the kind of commercial-filled primetime television we at CBS strive to create. And critics are already praising the decision, calling the new one-hour ad House of Cards Without the Intrigue meets the West Wing if President Bartlett was an out-of-touch media mogul jumping into the race last minute with a shit ton of money to burn. Here's a clip from the pilot commercial. By the way, I'm the only candidate in the race who doesn't take a penny in contributions from anyone. No big donors, no special interests, nothing. In the meantime, I'm traveling the country, speaking... I'm Mike Bloomberg, and I approve this message. Oh, wow. Sounds like we're gearing up for a real tearjerker as well. I'd love to hear more of that for 40 minutes straight. Right. Well, you can get even more than that, because not only will the hour-long episodes be broken up by 15- and 30-second commercial breaks already bought by the Bloomberg campaign, but CBS will be re-airing the Bloomberg 2020 episodic commercials during the week as many times as Mr. Bloomberg wants. I'm sold. Marcy, how can people tune in? Bloomberg 2020 campaign ad version 257B premieres this Tuesday night at 8, 7 central after NCIS. Ah, can't wait to Bloomberg and chill on Tuesdays. Oh, Leslie, don't, don't say that. OPR's Marcy Hammond, everyone. Sleep deprivation is a public health epidemic. It's estimated that almost one-third of Americans don't get the recommended seven hours of sleep every night. So how can you improve your sleep and lead a healthier, more enjoyable life? Well, a new study from the University of Washington suggests the best natural aid may be getting rocked to sleep by an old woman who cradles you in her big, soft bosom and sings you German lullabies. OPR's wellness correspondent Jenna Resnick is here to discuss the findings. Guten Tag, Leslie. <laughs> So, Jenna, tell us, how can finding yourself a stout German grandma help you sleep better? Well, sleep problems can be caused by a variety of issues from stress to diet, but scientists in this study found that resting your head in the soft, warm chest of an elderly German matriarch as she sings you songs of little dancing angels along the flowing Rhine River greatly calmed subjects' nerves and helped block out the sensory distractions that often lead to disrupted sleep. How effective was this method for the subjects? Very. Of the 400 people rocked to sleep by these heavy-chested German women, 86% reported falling asleep faster, and 91% said hearing the soft words of Vishtu Vihil Sternlein Stiehen while sipping her warm honey milk made them more energetic in the morning. That's a big improvement. And the researchers say that those who took the active placebo, no German grandma, no bosom, no lullaby, barely reported any change in their sleep habits. I actually tried this method myself and found it very effective. Guten Abend. You're hearing Helga, an 81-year-old woman from Essenbach, Germany. I'm currently cradled in her arms atop an old wooden rocking chair as she sings me the classic lullaby, Guten Abend, Gute Nacht. I can already feel my eyes getting heavy, all the worries of the world drifting away as I nuzzle deeper in her comforting bosom. <gasps> oh, I'm actually getting a little sleepy just hearing that. Absolutely. Helga was an extremely effective sleep aid. By the time she got to the part of the song about how little children will only wake up in the morning if God wants them to, I was out cold. Would love to find a way to sleep like that on the regular here in New York. (laughs) 
Tell me about it. So clearly, these mournful refrains of snow-capped mountains and wild Edelweiss fields can help with better sleep tonight, but what are some of the long-term benefits? Well, old German women rocking you to sleep can greatly reduce blood pressure, anxiety, and the risk of heart disease. But you do want to be careful which grandma you go with. You can also find old Italian nanas out there who will help you sleep with big plates of pasta and shots of limoncello. But some experts say they can be habit-forming. Old Russian women are another option that can be very powerful, but I actually experienced experienced an adverse reaction with one that left me more anxious and sleep deprived than before. What do you want? I don't understand. understand. Husband, no husband yet. Why will you not give me grandchildren? Please, I am so lonely. It wasn't a good match, but maybe for some people. I don't want to knock it if it works for you. Still, you would recommend listeners who have trouble sleeping get their own elderly German woman? Absolutely. You can find these women at supermarkets or German bakeries, usually for a pretty low price. Or just go to your local bra house and ask for someone's Oma. And of course, if you continue to struggle, you can ask your doctor to recommend one who is even older or has an even bigger bosom. Thanks, Jenna. That's OPR's Jenna Resnick. The Topical is brought to you by Simply Safe. You don't have Simply Safe. I know because I broke into your home today and checked. If you had Simply Safe, you would have known that and I'd be in police custody right now. A two-time winner of CNET Editor's Choice Award, Simply Safe has everything you need in a home security system. Outdoor cameras and doorbells alert you when I'm approaching your home. Entry motion and glass break sensors guard against me from snooping around inside and making myself a sandwich. So go to simplysafe.com/topical today. You'll get free shipping and a 60-day risk-free trial. You got nothing to lose. Go now and be sure to go to simplysafe.com slash topical. That's simplysafe.com slash topical. Oh, and by the way, you're out of toilet paper. That was going to be all for today, but then I suddenly started panicking thinking about you. Yes, you, going off on your day, unaware that there is more news out there. Here's what else you need to know today. The U.S. Navy is reporting that sailors are displaying all-time low levels of jauntiness. According to a Navy spokesperson, fewer naval officers are jovially breaking out into song than ever before in U.S. maritime history, and there have been disturbingly few cases of rollicking in the past calendar year. The Navy is reportedly starting initiatives to up the overall jauntiness in 2020. In consumer news, Bounty has unveiled a new line of ultra-thin paper towels for a more natural feeling when you're wiping up spills. A new ad campaign is touting how pure and raw it feels. Tired of all the paper in between you and the spill? Now you can clean up juice, jelly, mud, and everything in between with Bounty Ultra Thin Paper Towels. And in other news, I think I have a really great idea for an app, but I'd hate to get too deep into it and find out it already exists. Okay, so it's like Uber, but for people. Visit our website and let me know if you've heard of anything like that before. Well, the news never stops, but sometimes, unfortunately, a podcast has to. I got to go figure out what the hell else is going on so I can do another one of these suckers for tomorrow. This has been The Topical. I'm Leslie Price. And this podcast is produced by a team of wonderful reporters, sound editors, and more, all of whom I have either had or am actively having secret romantic affairs with. Basically, I've cheated on all of them with each other, if that makes sense. Anyways, Uber, but for people. Let me know.